heard. Have you, got, have you got a good shot? Okay. In elephant society, we actually divide the the, the sexes and the, the way they are grouped together. Breeding herd consists of Sorry, the matriarch, which is like the grandmother of the group, mm -hmm. and all the females with the babies. While your then you get the bulls. The bulls are by themselves most of the time, especially the older bulls. Mm -hmm. But at age 15, the young bulls get kicked out of the breeding herd and then they join in um, bachelor groups. We call them Askaris, which is a Swahili word for foot Red soul. Face, and then there's ones with the, the faces are just becoming blue. Those are the sub adults. Now, these guys are usually, they forage on the ground, they're seed eaters, but they roost in trees. So they can fly, but they fly like clumsy chickens. Mm -hmm. so it's what were they called again? Guinea fowl. Guinea fowl. Yeah, this is a, a helmeted guinea fowl, to be precise. Helmet. Of course, they're also part of the big five. Yeah. Now, the question I want to ask you, mm. why are they called the big five? Because they're not flying, I mean, they're not flying somewhere else. Mm -mm. Because they're the ones everyone wants to see? No. <laughs> That's actually from a marketing ploy that people came up with. But the real reason why they call the big five is actually the five most dangerous animals to hunt on foot. This the is actually this, this is the, five, the it? one, number one on the big five list. Yeah. Uh, this, uh, this animal has killed a lot of people. I mean, it looks like a docile cow. Yes, oh. it does. We have buffaloes in India. Yeah, but your buffaloes are tame. You've got the water buffalo. Yeah. This little bird inspired a Lion King character. Cool. They're always fiddling around on the ground, picking up little insects, and they're always scratching around in dung, also getting little grass. They're cold today. You can see their coat is a bit puffy. Mm. Eagle we have here. He looks a bit funny with his wings hanging down, because that's usually typical vulture behavior. So that is actually... From eagles, if you, the scientific name for these guys actually translates into the 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 warfare, mm. the bird of warfare. This is what it looks like. And it's fully, fully grown. It's a martial it's eagle. Martial eagle. because it's full of animal urine, but it's very good for your skin, believe it or oh. not. <laughs> <laughs> what happens during the rut is you have the big rams that will actively defend his harem of females. He will be chasing other rams away, he will be chasing the females together, and he's just constantly minding the girlfriends. Well, these guys then, they form bachelor groups. So these are like the losers. These guys are like the losers. They don't get any action. Oh. <laughs> yeah. But but what happens is, this male that has the girlfriends, so he's constantly chasing up and down, he doesn't have time to sleep properly, he doesn't have time to eat properly, and no one is there to groom him mm. because he's so busy, so he actually loses body condition. And then one of these guys see the opportunity, mm. and then they challenge him and they take over. And then he joins the bachelorhood. A male has four facial warts and a female has two facial warts. And that's how you can determine their sex. They're also quite feisty little critters. Uh, many a lion have actually met their maker from these guys because they've got very sharp little tusks. It constantly, while they eat, it's like So this is the Birchels of the Plain Zebra. In southern Africa we actually have three, three zebra species. The other two being the Cape Mountain Zebra and the Heart They don't really have a black and white stripes, they also have brownish stripes in between. Yeah. Although shut this angle. That's his good shot. Is that good? Yeah. Oh, I can't see it. Yeah. It's got to get much better than this though. Can everyone see it? Yeah. yeah. Kudu. Kudu. K-U-D-U. It's one of the larger antelope species we find. It's the second largest one. 
in the pot. Blend in, eh? Say again? They blend in like Very crazy. good camouflage. Very good camouflage. Take a little piece of grass like right this. Okay, just a seed. So everyone can just grab one. And send it around. I don't know, yours is busted. Mine's busted. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for the busted piece of grass. <laughs> just pass that along. Okay, so just pull is it not busted? <laughs> no, yours is fine. Okay. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so what I want you to do, take some spit. Okay. See the white part? White part. White part. Or the bottom part. Put it in between your fingers. This one. This part. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. put that. And then look what happens to your grass. Look at that. Oh, he's turning. Yeah. No, How is that? Yours is moving. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the more saliva you add, the more it twists, actually. <laughs> Here's another piece of yours. No, no. I'll spit on the same one. Yours, you must put yours on the other side. Put this bit on the other no, side. It's not working, is that? Yes, on that side. <laughs> 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 Magic! Cool.